Hi. Is this the mattress place? Yes. Yeah, look, I bought a mattress there about a few weeks ago, okay? And, uh, I don't know, I like it, I op like it smelled, like it, like I took the plastic off, and it stunk, you know? And, uh, I looked in the back underneath, and there was stitching, like really poor stitching, and I opened that up, and it was somebody's old bed. You gotta be kidding. No, I'm not kidding you, man. It was, it had urine, uh, stains, I don't know what the fuck you guys are selling me, but this shit stunk to high heaven. And I when? slept on this thing for two days. You bought this when? I bought this a couple months ago. And this fucking thing stinks like it's been in a fucking dumpster for like two years. And I've been sleeping on the fucking piece of shit. We don't sell reconditioned stuff, I know that. Well, you know... What's what's your last name? Anderson. Anderson? Yeah. A-N-D-E-R-S-O-N? That's right. And your address? Linden Boulevard. I'm going into the computer. Okay. I want to see what it is you bought. Well, I bought like a, uh, was a fucking full size or uh, queen size, some shit. That thing stinks. It's somebody else's, uh, uh, somebody, you know, before I had this, somebody was laying all over it and peeing on it. Who, who God knows if they fucking took shits on a fucking thing. Like, it's a toilet. And I was sleeping on this fucking stench wreck. You believe this? No. Of course not. Who the fuck, oh, shit, man. And on top of it, I fucking paid like $400 for this fucking junk. Your name is Anderson? That's right. Hey. Mike. N D E R. I bought it from some guy over there. He had uh, big, big, thick, you know, glasses. Bold guy with thick glasses. That's not you, is it? Nope. Okay. Not coming up on the book. Yeah. Well, you know, uh, I don't. I don't know if it's gonna come on there. The guy gave me like a, you know, a little discount on the tax, and that's probably what it is. No, that still should show up. <laughs> is your address? Yeah, Linden Boulevard, apartment two eight. I mean, I don't understand. I don't appreciate you guys selling me this shit. And I have I to pay four hundred dollars for this piece of junk, and then I, all of a sudden it's, a, it's somebody else's uh, urinal in the you back. Came, you came to Port Richmond. Port Richmond. Yeah, one right over there. And I, you know, my friend he told me that you guys got good deals, so I said okay, and it looked like a real nice, uh, you know, mattress, so I bought it. Was it a Sealy, a Serta, a Stearns and Porter? I don't, I don't know what the hell it is. All I know it's a fucking stink pot. That's what I know. You, this shit you smells your... like a fucking like a New York City subway. Do you have a ticket? Because your name's not coming up on my computer. No, I, I, any, anything that I had from that, that long ago, I, that's gone. I don't save shit like that. I'm not a pack rat, you know? You're saying like three, four months ago, though? Oh, like two months ago. Even two, yeah. It, it should be. I, don't, I don't save receipts. I'm not a fucking, uh, one of those people who just, you know, packs the lunch and then has it around for two days. Uh, let's see, the only other way I can check this is... Well, I'm, I'm over here with a fucking rash all over my body. And I'm, I'm pretty sure there's little fucking mites in there, because I feel things on me when I'm sleeping. You know? How would you feel if you all of a sudden you want to buy a nice mattress and it's I, a fucking I, urinal? I would be extremely upset. Yeah, extremely. well, that's, yeah, it's a all fucking right. urinal. Let me, let me get the manager. Okay. Hold on a second. Hello? Yes. When was... Oh, uh, he was trying to get your name up on a computer. Excuse me, this is the manager? Yeah. Yeah, okay, look. I don't know if you know what, what he told you. Yeah, he, yeah. two months ago, I purchased a, a, it was either full size or queen, but I don't know the difference. And I paid $400 for this shit, and you know what? It had stitching in the, underneath the side after I took the plastic off, and this shit's a fucking urinal. It has piss stains and all kinds of fucking shit. And I paid 400 for this fucking shit bag, like somebody was fucking using it as a toilet. Well, and I slept on that shit, and I have a fucking rash all over my body. Do you know the delivery date? No, I don't know that. I don't no, have. I'm you know trying what? to find to see what you bought. I can't. Okay, look, what look. I told. I'm gonna tell you what I told him. I don't save receipts. I, none of that stuff. I throw that shit in the garbage. I'm not a pack rat. I don't keep mm. things around. You know. I'm. I don't need to be doing accounting and you know, and having that stuff on record. So I throw it in the trash. And I'm about to throw this shit in the trash because you know, and yeah. I want my money back for that. Well, I have. Now, how would you feel? You go to a store and you pay four hundred dollars for a fucking urinal. To sleep on for two fucking months. I'd be aggravated. Uh, well, I'm fucking pretty aggravated and itchy. But I, I got to show that you bought it here. I got to get a receipt. My well, look, okay, even look. Even through my uh, own records. Even through my own records. This guy, okay, I don't know if he still works there. This fucking bald guy with thick fucking glasses. Thick He's glasses? Thick motherfucking And he told me, okay, look, my, my friend. I told my friend, all right, look, I need a mattress. I need a good price. And he said, okay, he knows his place in uh, whatever the fuck you guys are, Richmond, whatever the hell that is. And he says, okay, so I'm going to go pick that shit up. You know, I pay $400 thinking this is a good fucking piece of mattress, you know? And it's a fucking urinal. It smells like the subway. Like some fucking piss bum 
let we loose all over it. We don't sell that stuff. We only sell new stuff. What are you talking about? You don't sell. Who the fuck sells urinal mattresses? There's got to be. But Obviously, it's a mistake. I, I, yeah, I know. I understand. But the fact of the matter is, somehow this fucking, this shit bag of a mattress found its way into your warehouse and into my home. And I want my money back. I'm not paying 400 to sleep on a fucking urinal. I just got to verify the fact that you bought it here. Okay, well, I don't Whether know. Whether it be through my records. Or I don't, don't have the receipt. receipt. I'm real sorry, but I don't have the receipt. All right, but uh, I, I got to get it on. Uh, you know, we keep records, too. I would have it on my records. Oh, well, let's, let's um, see if you got Because I don't know. This guy. Uh, that's, I, why I, that's why I asked you if you have any Does the guy still work there? This fucking bald son of a bitch that sold me this piece of shit? Um, I, well, let me know if he's still there, because no, I'll come down there, and I'll, and I'll say thank you. Well, he's not here. A uh, uh, guy with thick glasses? Thick, bald guy. Did Jeffrey have glasses? Jeffrey. He didn't wear glasses. Jeffrey, huh? Yeah, he don't wear glasses. Okay, Jeffrey. Does he? Thick glasses? Really? Tells you how much I notice things. All right, see, um, you guys... But he's no, he's no longer here. I hope not, because that fucking, that idiot took my money, and he gave me a fucking dirt bag of a mattress that's not even a bum will sleep on yeah, this shit. He probably didn't even know. Well, I, yeah. He, he, he wouldn't... Uh, Hopefully he didn't know. Hope, no, hope for, his, for his own sake, he no, didn't he, know. He wouldn't know. We wouldn't do that to somebody. You know? Um, and you know, on top of it, I paid a $50 delivery shit for this fucking, this, this shit to be... We're, we're no, I did, I used my own delivery, but... Oh. I, I paid $50 for this shit bag to be toted in, and moved into my house, and then I'm sleeping on it for, you know... I don't like sleeping on, on plastic, so I took this shit off, and this shit stunk. It stinks like fucking ass and, and urine. What, what's your address again? Linden. Linden. Linden what? Linden Boulevard, sir. Linden Boulevard? Yes. What's the zip code? 11208. I'm in Brooklyn. Brooklyn, BLC. And your name is Anderson. A yeah, -N Mike. -E -E Mike. Mike Anderson. S O N? Yeah, S O N. All right. Well, I got to try to look through my records and find this. Well, I mean, that what, What's your phone number? What, 718 346? Uh, I don't. Th this is not how you know people do business. You know, you know, selling this shit bag of a fucking mattress over here. I just want to verify it was purchased here. Uh, My whole body has uh, uh, sores from the stench, the stench that me, emits me, from the inside of that thing. Yeah, let me try to get. Let me try to look through my record and see if I can find something. You okay, look. About, about two months ago. All right, look. I got a better idea. Yeah. How about I take this fucking uh, this bag of urine and I ship it back down there, and you guys take a look at it and see if if that came from you guys. Because I know it, it fucking hell did come. I bought $400 out of my fucking pocket for this shit. And I'm going to bring it back, and you guys are going to see, and you give me my money back. How's that? I can't do that until I verify you bought it here. Well, I mean, it got the stickers, right? It got the stickers on it that Remember, says... Well, I couldn't give back money anyway because I'm not authorized to do it. I, I don't own this. Oh, all of a sudden, you guys don't do refunds. Uh, no, I'm not saying we don't do refunds. I'm saying I can't give out money. It's not... Well, I, what am I going to do? Sleep on this one more night? No, this... this Whenever it, there's a refund involved or money given back, it has to be done through the owner of the... It has to be done yeah, look, I paid $400 for this shit. I'm not debating it. All I'm telling you is I'm not authorized. To, I can't take money and give it well, to Well, is anybody. my money going to come back at some point? At, first of all, the first thing i got to do is, is find out a copy of this bill to verify and see what you bought. Look, okay. look. There ain't nobody giving back money without... Oh, oh, oh without you're not going to give me back my money, money, right? No, oh, I'm not no. saying that. Oh, so then i got to fucking sleep on this shit bag, and you're going to keep my phone? Okay. I'm not saying that. All right, that. so you know what, then? Uh, I am not I'm going to come that. down in about maybe an hour. You're not going to get anything because there ain't nobody here look, who can give you money. Look, I'm going to come back in an hour. I'm bringing this fucking thing in some truck, and I'm going to fucking leave it with you guys. You understand? I don't want this fucking shithole in my house. I don't even know for sure you bought it here. Well, look, Until I'm pretty I fucking sure I put $400 of this shit. shit in there. Oh. You understand me? $400. You think, you think that's okay for me to no, be spending $400 for, anyone for, to lose $400 for me to sleep on no. a urinal? I don't think, no, I don't think that's okay. No, that's not good, right? Of course not. Of course not. So what I'm going to do in, in about an hour, I'm going to see you and that guy, and hopefully he I won't, won't see uh, uh, Baldy over there, because no, if be I see Baldy, Baldy's going to catch one. He won't be here, because he oh, doesn't work okay, here. Okay, good, because I'm going to bring back, I don't want this mattress in my house. I'm going to bring it back to where I bought it, and that's you guys. And I'll see you in an hour. You understand? All right. But and, then, and, then, and then from there on, I'll, I'll, I'll see what we could do about the money. Well, I, I'm telling you now, I can't give you any money. Well, we'll see what we could do. We'll, we'll set something to be up. done. I can't give you any well, money. Well, you said you got to look for my records. So in Even that, if I found your records, I can't give you okay, money. Okay, well, that's good. Okay, so we'll set up some kind of uh, uh, paper saying that, yeah, 
this should happen and that. So I'm going to be down an hour. An hour is a good enough time for you to look through your records, and I'll have that mattress with me. Okay? I can't stop you from coming down. Here. Well, I'll be there. I can only tell you what I can do and what I can't do. All right, so I'll see you in an hour, okay? Again, I can't stop you from coming down. I'm going to be down there with well, a fuck with this shit bag of a mattress. You understand? Well, I'll see you in an hour. If you come, fine. Okay, I mean, I I'll see you. Goodbye. Time. I got to go. Okay. I'll see you in an hour.